will find stuff like this along fence license, fence lines, bushes. It's a Tuesday morning and Buffalo Police's K-9 Corps is training to make sure they're at their strongest when it comes to keeping you and me safe. And while some of that training like taking down a suspect. The dog ran past the handler and engaged the suspect. And we're all standing here. It's awesome environmental conditioning. Or sniffing out explosives like Patty here is still intact. There is one part of their training when it comes to finding drugs. It's not, and it hasn't been in years. The department, as of a couple years ago, stopped training our narcotics dogs in the detection of marijuana to begin with. As of now, Captain Jeff Ronaldo Patty. says only a couple of dogs in service are still trained to sniff out marijuana. But once those four-legged officers retire, he says replacement dogs will be trained in different services. Which brought us to our next question. Good boy. What if a current canine detects marijuana? It's no different than being in illegal possession of cigarettes or alcohol as long as you're not uh, utilizing it while you're operating a motor vehicle. Now remember the legal amount nice job. is up to three ounces in New York State. If there's an instance where a larger illegal stash is found, that's where larger departments like Order. the Niagara County Sheriff's Office could come in. Good boy. You know Canine what? You, you, Reggie is 13 months old and currently undergoing his training. Uh, at this point we haven't made a decision if we are going to imprint the odor of marijuana to make him a marijuana detection dog. Lieutenant James Hildreth says the sheriff's office is still waiting on guidance from the state and the DA on how to proceed. <coughs> Until then, Reggie will be imprinted on other narcotics. Because there are certain circumstances where a marijuana detection dog is a useful asset to have, and whether it be inside the schools or um, the postal service. For both law enforcement agencies, though, there is one thing that's certain. Canine units are not going anywhere. They are a crucial part of our unit. I can't even, as you can see, like trying to come up with the perfect words. Um, they are the constant backup officer. Not to mention who doesn't love seeing the canines out and about at events and saying hello.